Hi. With the saxophone being a very loud instrument, many people struggle to make it quieter. And as you may know or even tried, it's very hard to make the saxophone quiet. It's because the sound goes out of every open hole, not just from the bell. So you cannot just mute the bell and call it a day. You need to cover all the holes. So I took four methods that work to make the saxophone quieter and measured the results. Each time with a calibrated sound pressure level, one meter from the saxophone. <laughs> Quick explanation. The decibel scale is logarithmic, so every 10 decibels is doubling in volume. So 80 decibels is twice as loud as 70 decibels and 90 decibels is four times as loud as 70 decibels. Back to you. <laughs> It's worth to mention that the saxophone is 5 decibels louder from the front than from the side and even 10 decibels louder from the front than from the back. Method 1. Playing in the closet. You just walk into the closet that's full of clothes and play the sax. Pros. It's free, there's no change to the technique and feel of the instrument and if you have a big closet it's okay. Cons. It's uncomfortable and it gets quite hot really fast. Method 2. A sax mute. You place the saxophone in the sax mute, close the latches and play. Pros. It mutes the sax very well. At about minus 25 decibels, it makes your sax sound at the level of a loud conversation. The cons. It changes how you play, it's harder to blow and a lot harder to get out the low notes. It makes the sax very heavy, it's hard to play standing, but it's fine when playing sitting down and placing the sax mute between the legs. It's pricey, above 500 USDs, but there are cheaper options for about 430 USD dollars. Method 3. A cardboard box. You just cut some holes into a big box and put the saxophone inside it. Pros. It works. It attenuates only 6 decibels, but it's a noticeable difference. And I think with some modifications this could really work well. Cons. It takes a lot of space, it restricts your movement inside. Uh, you need to be stationary and it kind of looks funny. Method 4. 
a Maha 4C. Just change your mouthpiece and a read to a beginner one and it enables you to play a little quieter. Pros. It enables you to be a little quieter and it's cheap. The cons. It makes you play a little different. <laughs> As you can see, each of the methods I tried has its pros and cons. If you want the most attenuation, the sax mute is a clear winner, but it comes with a set of drawbacks. The cardboard box seems interesting, I will try to do some upgrades on it and maybe make a video about the progress and the results. As for me, I like playing in a closet or outside in the park or near a busy street. If you have any questions or maybe some funny stories about loud saxophone playing, you can leave them below. If you want to support me, you can buy me a coffee or join my Patreon page. And thank you so much for 1000 subscribers. Yeah. Goodbye and keep practicing.